In this quick video, we will be going over a very budget option for improving your audio in a small space like this. What's up everybody, I'm Jake McHugh and this channel is all about making better videos. I do gear reviews and test videos to help you determine what gear you need to make the videos you want to achieve. If this is something that may interest you, consider hitting that subscribe button down below. Regardless of how nice of a mic you have or how much you pay for one, most times that can only do so much. You will always have some type of reverb or echo when shooting in untreated rooms, especially if you don't have carpet on the floor. I think the best thing you can do is treat your room in some way, but this can become very expensive very quickly and sound blankets isn't the cheapest solution either. Here enters the DIY version of sound blankets, which is moving blankets, and these are very cheap and can be found at your local hardware store or Amazon. These blankets are heavier or denser than your normal blankets, and these are used for moving your nicer appliances and prevent them from being scratched or banged up. While they're not as dense as actual sound blankets, they do make a big difference in eliminating the echo in a room. This is something I've been doing for a while already, and I feel like it helps out a lot since I'm using a more budget-friendly microphone, which is the Rode Video Micro. I'm fortunate enough to have a drop ceiling here in my studio, and I just easily clamp them to the ceiling either using a spring clamp like this or a clothespin, but you could also use big thumbtacks and tack them to the wall as well. As you can see here, I've even gone as far as Velcroing one to my door, as doors with their smooth surfaces and construction material tend to reflect a lot of sound easily, and this has helped a lot in this room. Another way to mount these is to get a heavier light stand or C-stand, one preferably with wheels, and using a small brake clamp to attach a rod like a telescopic shower curtain rod, and using spring clamps to attach the blankets this way. By attaching the small rig clamp to the light stand, you can then clamp the shower curtain rod horizontally to attach the moving blankets to, and you can position it just out of frame and have a small little booth to record in. By getting a telescopic shower curtain rod, it really slides down into a small size for storing and packing. I recommend listening to this next part with headphones, that way you can hear the difference the best. As you can hear right now, this is without any moving blankets hung up, and this is what it sounds like. There seems like to be a little bit more echo in the room. Check one, two, check one, two. And now this is what it sounds like with the moving blankets up, and I personally feel like I can tell a difference already just talking like this. Check one, two, check one, two. Overall, I think these moving blankets have been the best cheap upgrade for my production quality other than my mic, which is the Rode Video Micro, which you are listening to right now. I highly recommend picking up a few of these and handing them around in the room you're recording in and hearing the difference for yourself. And the best part is that you can find these really cheap sometimes at your local hardware store or home improvement store. I happen to find these ones at my local Harbor Freight and I think I've only paid like three bucks a piece for each one. So that's gonna do it for this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed it and got something out of it. If you like this video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button down below subscribe if you haven't already and make sure you hit the bell that way you get notified when i drop future videos just like this one here and last but not least i will catch you guys in the next video